Hi. Hey, Laura. What's happening? How are you? So uh, I was just I was just telling them I was waiting for you to come on. I'm like super pumped about this, and I I was using the 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 chi last night, maybe 15 minutes, and I was like already feeling detox effects. Like I got a little nauseous and a little. I was like, whoa, it's powerful to say the least. Oh yeah, you might yeah. start breaking out with acne too. <laughs> I don't need that. I'm already pregnant. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Um, so for pe for the people that aren't aren't really familiar with frequencies, I talk a lot about Healy, but Chi Coil is is very different. And if if you'd like to start describing about the company, like as the owner, you know. Yeah. Okay. Well, Healy is a great product. Uh, lots of people use it. Lots of people have lots of success with it. Just the main difference is that Healy is microcurrent, and we are pulsed electromagnetic field. So with Healy. You have to, uh, you know, use the wires, but they do have a new thing come out with a with a small coil, uh, which is basically kind of like my idea. Uh, the, the main difference is just the the power of it. It's just so much stronger with the cheek coils. Like the cheek coils, yeah. uh, you can measure it if you turn it up full full blast with like the the biggest amplifier we have. You can measure it around twenty feet away from from the from the device. So you have it anywhere near you. You don't even have to touch it. You can put it on your desk. You can put it under your seat. You can put it under your belt. Uh, you can put it under your your partner's seat or desk. <laughs> without... I'll be doing that. <laughs> <laughs> or you can put it near your kid's bed or something or in or on the kitchen table or in the living room. So it just creates such a strong feel that everybody in the house will benefit from it. And that's that's the main difference. Another main difference is that we have over 10,000 frequencies and programs, some that are not available anywhere on the internet. We have 800 very unique and specific quantum frequencies you won't find anywhere. Uh, Healy, I think, only has about 80 programs or something like that. Um, so just way more programs. Uh, we have um, a lot more selection when it comes to the different things you can do. For example, we have DMT. <laughs> we have like ayahuasca if you want to get like a psychotropic experience we have um you know mind expansion if you want to get into meditation you got everything from detox to um weight loss to male enhancement uh like brain enhancement so many things like you name it we have it so, there's literally a frequency for everything that's what i tell people i'm like there's yeah. a frequency for everything right <laughs> Because I ask people, well, what if there's a technology? There's one day we have technology where we have like some kind of dashboard and then we just select what we want to feel, select what kind of attributes we want in ourselves. It's like making a new avatar for yourself. What if you can do that, right? Yeah, you can program, wild. you can make your appearance. <laughs> it's like a video game. You can change your appearance. You can change your like make, body makeup and everything. And you just press a button and then it changes you like that. <laughs> It just gives you this like new image of yourself, a new version of yourself. For well, sure. Uh, yeah. So this is pretty much it. This is what pretty much it. The cheek quills. Okay. We have the tablet. Okay. This is the panel. This is the panel with over 10,000 frequencies of programs. And literally you can kind of stop, but literally you can choose that whatever you want. It's like a self-driving car. Like you said, like before we have self-driving cars, we have to rely on GPS to tell us where to go. Before GPS, we had to have a map. But now we have self-driving cars. You just say, where do you want to go? Okay, I want to get healthier or I want to be uh, more focused. I want to do better in school. I want to be, uh, uh, I want to heal myself. So that's the destination. You just choose whatever destination you want. And then the car will take you there and you can go to sleep if you want. You don't even have to drive. <laughs> You're not supposed to, but some people do. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, you don't have to drive. You don't have to ask people for directions. You don't have to look at the GPS. You don't have to like, okay, someone telling you, okay, you got to do this, you got to do this. You, gotta, you just press a button and then the car takes you there automatically. So this is what technology is. This is where, how advanced we are now, right? You just select what you want in your life, what you want to become, and then it'll take you there automatically. Because the science isn't new. The science has been around. The, the technology has taken it to the next level. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, so what are your, so obviously you use it every day. What is like your go-to program when you're like, I have to do this every single day. Like this is part of my routine, my. Mm -hmm. 
uh, I use the life force pretty much every day. I use the sleep pretty much every day. I use the abundance. Uh, I use the uh, five for focus. So those are the main main ones. Uh, sometimes I might use like the DMT and the ayahuasca and the reality bending ones. Uh, sometimes if I want to be more creative, I might use the like the um, like the third eye one. So yeah, all those different ones. If you have any specific like conditions I need to deal with, I'll use the RIFE frequencies. Let's say I have um, you know a bloated stomach, I ate too much, <laughs> then I would <laughs> I would use the frequency for uh, intestinal inflammation, and then you know it'll all be gone in about thirty minutes. Yeah. Uh, if I have um, I don't know, you know, let's say I worked out really hard and then my joints are aching or my muscles aching, I'll just use a uh, regenerative one, and then. Next morning, I feel like I, you know, I'm ready to go again. So yeah, yeah. Um, and I was noticing. So you have you have the option for the single coils, in the like the, in the in the different us uh, editions. Mm -hmm. What the yin and the yang coil? Can you talk more into that? Right. Okay. So if you haven't seen what these coils look like, let me just grab one over here. So here I have the um, the mini. So this is our. Hey Kim. <laughs> this is the mini. All right. So it comes with one or it comes with two. This is the transducer. So this is the wired version. We also have a, a Bluetooth version, which basically just replaces this with the gold one, which is Bluetooth. <laughs> Yeah. So this is the one uh, Laura has now. She has two of these. So um, they're very small. You see, they're two and a half inches. And uh, they're very compact, but they're still powerful. So um, this is like kind of like the entry levels version. And then when you upgrade, there's um, the, the she called threes, which are uh, a lot stronger. And mm -hmm. they have crystals inside. And it comes with a lot more frequencies. And these ones start having the yin and yang. I, I don't have my yin and my yang with me. But basically, they uh, have two different directions of winding. So you see this one goes this way. The other one goes the other way. Um, yin, if you use the same frequency, you don't have to change frequency. If you use yin with the same frequency, it feels more expansive, feels more relaxing. Yang, using the same frequency, it feels more condensing and activating. So what happens is um, you can use both at the same time, and it'll give you a very balancing, centering, calming, uh, energetic field. So that gives you three different ways of using them. That's yeah. how you have the uh, yin and yang. So, uh, and then we have our Chico Max, which is our largest one. So these are five inches. It's amazing. It's dual layer. It can go uh, 20 feet. So it can cover a room about like 400 square foot or so. And these have six crystals and it comes with a uh, more powerful um, uh, uh, transducer. So um, this will cover, a, you know, a, nicely in a living room or a, a kitchen or a, a large room. Yeah. So those are different ones. Will help you with the lifestyle that involves the C word. Um, the, the key thing is the right frequency. And the key thing is the um, right amount or enough juice or enough power, enough of the magnetic field. So I would recommend at least getting this one because it has a larger field and then getting one of the larger transducers to boost up the field. This will boost it up more than these. Ones. So these ones are good. These are really strong by themselves. This one you have, and you're already detoxing in 15 minutes, right? But uh, if you want to really get the full effect, then you get one of these over here. And those are 11 times stronger than this. Can you, can you pan your camera over so they can see? Uh, yeah, let me just bring it over here. Oh, okay. So you get this one, and you get 11 times more power. Wow. Yeah. So actually, with the Chi Coil Maxes, it comes with this. But if you get the three, it will be an upgrade. You can upgrade to this one. And then you're probably wondering, what the heck is this over here? <laughs> <laughs> so these are our Aura Coils. These are the professional models. So these are used in clinics or large homes and luxury homes. So they come mm. with uh, gold plated um, and sapphires, and uh, these can cover three thousand square feet with our with our technology. Wow. Yeah. So 
Oh, um, amazing. Yes, and if you, anyone with questions similar to that, I encourage you to do research on the the origin of those frequencies. Yeah, so the, the frequencies, as I mentioned, is the important part. So we have all of the C frequencies that you need. So every specific one you think of, it's in here. Yeah. And not just C, right? Because there's many things that we uh, need as well. Like, for example, uh, regeneration or blood circulation or detox. Uh, anything that related to your general wellness and recovery. You see how many there are? I'm still not. I'm still scrolling, <laughs> and I haven't haven't finished yet. So I'm still scrolling, 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 and there's the end of the list. So that's probably like 200 of them in there. Yeah. Uh, pain management really good for that as well. Uh, anything mm -hmm. to do with digestion. That's how I heal myself. By the way, if you don't know, my story is um, I had ulcerative colitis for 10 years. Completely incurable, bleeding every day, had no energy. I had brain fog. I was in depression and in pain every day of my life. I can't even leave the house. But then I started experimenting with frequency technologies, started making my own device. I used to combine my own software. And then in 90 days, I healed myself. And the doctor's like, what the heck happened? What did you do? Did you take our medication? I said, yeah, but I stopped and I, your medication sucks. And uh, it didn't work, and it gave me side effects. So I, I'm using this technology. And they, they say, what? What is this? And they, they wouldn't even believe I did it. So, and yeah, 90 days, I was completely healed. And then my life was completely, completely transformed. I regained all my strength and energy, and my um, mood improved a lot. I, had, uh, I stopped all the bleeding, no more problem. And now I can eat pretty much any food I want. You know, if you have that situation where you're intestines are bleeding internally you can't eat you can eat maybe like five one percent of the food that a regular person eats you have to be very very strict with your diet now i don't have that uh, i'm still you know obviously I still um you know have a you know uh strategic diet but i don't it's not like i can't eat fried chicken or i can't eat fish or i can't eat uh spicy food i can eat it now right um so that's a huge bonus uh, yeah. and, and ever since then, I just decided to help other people because I started helping my parents uh, who, you know, my mom who had a knee injury or knee problem. And then I used the Chico as the first thing. And within 15 minutes, the pain went down by 50%. And she was on pain meds at that time. And they weren't, work they weren't working for her. So this is the only thing that worked for her. And then um, my, my dad had severe insomnia and then the, all the sleeping pills didn't help him either so there's so many cases where um medication doesn't work or if it works it gives you side effects right or, or you build a toddler yeah yeah so so um i said i think i hit something pretty pretty amazing here because i'm able to help my parents without any pills or surgery and just use pure frequency pure energy to do it yeah. it's like something from star trek <laughs> and then, and uh and then you know my gears start turning say like, you know i gotta get this out there i gotta get this i gotta make this a really attractive product i gotta make it easy for pretty people to use i gotta make it effective powerful and that's what you have now and the awesome thing about frequencies is there's no side effect and if there's no resonance nothing happens like you can't you, you can OD, so to speak, but it's just detox symptoms. It's not, it's not going to do any damage. That's what I feel like people can't really comprehend about using frequencies is with pharmaceuticals. There's always a side effect, you yeah. know, it doesn't matter. And they have a list of like 50 expensive. side effects. Yeah. <laughs> Hair loss or, or eczema right. or loss of sight or weakness, <laughs> shortness of breath or heart palpitations or death or something right? <laughs> so are there so are there any contraindications because i know there's there's a handful for microcurrent but are there any for like what would the yeah the there are there are some for for pulse electromagnetic field therapy so if you have any like pacemakers we don't recommend you use it or any kind of like uh, metal implants it may cause some discomfort so um the, but the thing with these ones you can you can choose how powerful they are how much you turn them up right so you can always just test it out with a very low setting and see um, if it affects you in any way or you have any discomfort. And most of the time, people won't have that issue. 
Um, you're not supposed to use it during pregnancy. That's what they say, but then people still use it. You're not supposed to use it if you are on iron, like a lot of iron um, uh, supplements. I play pretty loose and fast with the whole pregnancy rule because I just feel like if you're, if you're at a lower setting, this is just my personal, you know, choice. I don't recommend this to anybody, but you know, I give myself enough distance, you know, I kind of let them go in the room to emanate through the room and then, but like I said, yeah. the, the other, Oh, go ahead. Yeah. So, so there's kind of like two ways of using this. Okay. There's the active and the passive way. So I mentioned how you can just leave it in a room uh, on a coffee table or uh, in the kitchen and just have it playing. So that's a passive way of using it. And when you do that, you can just leave, turn it up to one out of 10. But what's happening is you're, you're getting this micro dose of uh, electromagnetic energy. This is micro dose of um, magnetic field energy. And I think everybody can benefit from that. So the whole house, everybody, all the plants, even all the food that's around it also would get energized. And just having this micro dose of energy over a long period of time will be just really great for you. Just really great for your body and general health and well-being. So that's the passive way. And I don't think that will even affect anybody who um, has implants. And it's just the field is not, not that strong. It's not... It's so low that it's not going to really affect you that much, but over, it will it will help you over time. So that's the passive way. So, but the active way is to crank this up to the maximum and use it at full power. Uh, and when you do that, you just got to make sure that you don't use it for too long because you might detox too much or it might cause you to be dizzy uh, or nauseous. Yeah. Yeah. And like I said, if you do that, you turn up maximum. You may not need it for more than 15 minutes, maybe just 30 minutes a day. And this is your original, this is your design from the, the Taurus. I read that too. Yeah, so trail. this is my design. This, this unique design is mine. Obviously, there's other people that made this Taurus before I did. But then this unique device is my design. Yeah. Uh, and that's patent pending. So... So I kind of put my own artistic and engineering skills to, to work. Um, so they're beautiful. Yeah. And also, we're the only ones with the crystal chambers inside of these ones. And nobody else has that uh, with the continuum crystals. Like if you, you can't really see them in, because they're inside of it. But mm. if I take them out, they look like this. So they have these uh, citrine crystals inside of them. So you're probably asking, well, what's the benefit of the crystals? Well, if you know, use crystals, then you probably know, but if you don't use crystals, crystals have resonance and they have memory. So if you have them in the coils while they're running, they're getting programmed, getting charged up. So when you're not using coils, you're not even plugging them in, there's crystals inside. You can hold these, you can bring these with you anywhere and it will still resonate through crystal resonance. That's a cool thing. That's amazing. That's incredible. Yeah. And how did you decide on citrine? Uh, well, citrine is pretty much quartz. And it's just, it's like the abundance of prosperity version of quartz. Mm. That's why I chose citrine. Yeah. With the iron supplements, I was actually just reading about, um, it's, I think it's more fortified iron. F foods with fortified iron you have to look out for because they've been doing tests and you can actually a magnet will pick it up if you blend up. I think that they were doing cereals and breads and stuff. And it's, mm -hmm. they're putting like, like tangible pieces of iron in the food now. So I can only yeah. imagine what that would do. Yeah. So that would be the issue. So the, the question was, how is this different than PMF? This is PMF. PEMF. It is a. It is PMF, uh, but um, uh, a couple more steps beyond that. Okay. So PMF they have frequencies from zero to 30 Hertz. That's mainly what the science is, has been researched on, just 30 to zero Hertz in a very low frequency range. Most of the devices you see, see are these mats that you lie on. Um, you may see some like these tubes that have you know, magnetic energy around them. They use them for horses and so on. Um, so the main difference is that we go beyond that 30 Hertz. We go above that. 
like we go up to 100 hertz, we go up to 20,000 hertz actually. So we, our technology contains the PMF frequencies, which is zero to 30. So we have all those, but we extend the range to the full 20,000. And that's where the RFE frequencies come in. So that's the main difference. Another main difference is that we're non-contact PMF because these are so so condensely so condensed and so um, strong that you don't need to be on the mat. You don't need to touch them to receive the energy. You just have to be around them. So it's completely non-contact. So that's one key thing about our technology is it's completely non-contact. And like I said. Another bonus is that if you have a partner that you've been wanting to help, you have kids that you want to be help, and they don't want to do anything. They don't want to take supplements. They don't want to go on any mat. They don't want to do healing. They don't want to do anything, right? You can't convince them to do anything. Well, now they're going to get this whether they like it or not. Yes. <laughs> right? That was like my biggest thing. I was like, the house, everybody's getting it. They yeah. have no choice now. <laughs> they have no choice. You, do, you turn it on, and they're getting it, whether they want it or not, Okay. So that's, that's the neat thing. That's the uh, very unique advantage that we have uh, because of the non-contact um, aspect of it. And how long, um, how long has uh, Chi Coil been? Like when, when did you start the company? Like how long, when did- Four when years. We're four, four years. years. Yeah, we've been around. Um, and yeah, so we've ha we have thousands of customers. This is actually like our fourth generation of the coils. This is our fifth generation of the coils. So we've done a lot of improvements and testing and retesting and refinements in our stuff. So um, we've been around. We have people use them for pretty much anything you can think of. Uh, we have, um, you know, a, a couple who healed um, this person's back who had uh, chronic pain for 30 years. So he had this injury that he never healed for 30 years and he used our coils and he completely healed and and mm -hmm. his personality changed too by the way because he, he was so much he was in so much pain before he was very irritable and didn't get along and then they were having you know relationship issues at that time but then after he healed his personality changed because no more there was no more pain and he became a lot nicer to his wife and they got along a long, long, lot better and then uh, you know the, the lady's telling oh my god what did you do with my husband it's a different person <laughs> <laughs> It's crazy because you get you get so programmed to think you have to live with this pain and you have to live with this chronic illness and it's it's just not true, mm -hmm. you know. When you when you start incorporating frequencies, like everything changes and then it's like I don't, you know. At first, I didn't even know who I was after the like without the pain and I was just so used to being in pain all the time and mm -hmm. miserable that I was like, oh, so this is what life is supposed to be like, you know. Exactly. This is how I'm supposed to feel. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes we, we just live so long in that lack or in that pain that we kind of get accustomed to it. We kind of start accepting it and starting to just justify it and get comfortable. Um, but luckily you're here, so that's great. Yeah. Uh, one of the questions was um, asking about results for uh, neuropathies, healing neuropathy. So... Um, I'm not the expert on that, but um, this has something to do with um, nerves, right? Nerves, and I believe um, for most people that I've spoken to, it starts in the feet and then begins to travel up their legs. There's you a lot like of restless leg syndrome and things like that. Uh, numbness. Numbness. Pain. Okay. Yeah. So my mom had a stroke, so that could be something similar. So you lose, basically, you lose control and strength uh, and sensitivity in basically half of your body because of the brain, one side of the brain is, uh, is damaged. So um, since she's using our technology, um, she recovered way faster than all the other people that had a stroke around the same time. And uh, she has a lot more strength and then it helps her with the pain as well. So um, I think that it helps with the uh, supporting the nervous system, supporting with the brain, supporting because what you're actually doing is you're are charging up your nervous system with more mm. electricity. You, your body has more voltage. So let's say you have nerves that are damaged, and it would potentially send stronger signals to your nerves so that they can communicate better. So as I said, I'm not the expert. I can't say that it's going to heal, but um, I have seen very good results with my mom 
And I know that what this does is it does um, increase the um, electrical activity in your body. So uh, I probably think it would support somebody like that. Yeah. I think we've been, we've been so accustomed to just taking a pill. People don't realize that your body has an electrical charge. And when that charge starts to dissipate, nothing, nothing, nothing works, you know, and it just compounds. So when you, when you can start working from an energetic level and that, and build off from there, then everything just expands, you know, from the, the level of energy to subatomic particle, the atom, then the cell, then the tissue, the organ, and then the whole body. And I feel like with this, it is so powerful. Like, again, like I couldn't believe in just the 15 minutes I was, you know, and I was like farting around my room, like getting packed and everything. And I was like, I need to sit down. I'm a little nauseous, you know, but it, it you know, I had it. And I, I think I, I turned, I used, um, the acidosis frequency sequence and it's it's no joke like you feel it and i don't i think a lot of people are so used to that immediate sensation from a pharmaceutical whereas this is you know a little more subtle unless you go too high or too fast too much you know mm -hmm. but then over time it's and i always encourage people when they start using frequencies i'm like keep a journal because you'll forget your ailments you'll forget the pain you know as it as it slowly starts to dissipate and then it leaves your life and you're like, Oh yeah, I haven't had that. I haven't had that in, you know, yeah. a couple weeks now. We actually have a journal that comes with, with the package, right? Yes. <laughs> so you, here you can track everything. You can track your sleep, your energy, vitality, strength, stamina, mobility, flexibility, weight, focus, clarity, motivation, productivity, creativity, mood, confidence, skin and hair appearance, stress and anxiety, pain and inflammation or anything that else you want to track. So, you know, you can track, the you know the next day seven days 15 days 30 days you can track your improvements so this is very useful yes and the website too the website's so impressive there's just it's like so much information i was like wow like i'm gonna have to do a deep dive <laughs> i'm gonna need to get a babysitter and do a deep dive but <laughs> it's really impressive because a lot of a lot of companies don't go that in depth with their product and you know how it works the information behind it and you know, yeah. I found well, it. This, yeah. So this is my life. That's uh, what I've been doing for the last four years. And, and this is the, uh, I have just so much to, I'm learning all the time. So I just have so much to share and so much to, to, to teach to people. Yeah. And I love teaching and people say I, uh, I'm a good teacher. So that's, I, I keep on coming up with all these videos all the time and have, you know, if you want to check it out, go to my YouTube channel. It's called David Wong, Chi Life Mastery. I have 400,000 subscribers. We have documentaries. We have educational videos. We have martial arts, everything. We have frequencies on there, like lots of things. I've been, you know, you have eight years of videos on there that you can dive into. Everything you need to know about Chico's, like our webinars that you can look, you can work, uh, watch and learn about the technology uh, because there's so many layers that um, I've incorporated into this technology because you just see, oh, it's just a yellow coil, but there's actually many layers of things happening in there. For example, um, the frequencies themselves, we have four levels of frequencies, uh, right? And they're all in here. But the thing is, a lot of people understand what the RFE frequencies are, but then there's frequencies actually that have more dimensions than that RFE. RFE is just one dimension because there's only one frequency at a time, even though it's a series of, let's say, five frequencies, you play one at a time. But what if you play two frequencies at a time? What if you play three frequencies at a time? What if you created um, frequencies from geometric shapes? What if you use frequencies from um, natural, um, uh, what do you call it, the uh, sacred geometry, like phi or pi, or the pyramids of the uh, uh, angles of the pyramid, right? What if you use um, frequencies based on astrological coordinate coordinates, right? So there's so many layers of ways to express frequencies and express reality and we basically have it all like what if like how do we do make the dmt frequency or what if we take the dmt molecule dimethyltryptamine and then we put it in the software program and then we find out all the angles the molecular mass and the weights and then we spin it and then find out what numbers come out of the software and then make a frequency from that what if they did that well that's what we did so <laughs> 
So and nobody's done it like that. So basically, when you're playing that, it's creating this holographic projection of that molecule directly to you, directly to your into your body. So actually, maybe you can listen to it right now. I love <laughs> listening to this. People, people listen to this during the lives, and they're like, they're like, they're like just like blank out. Okay, I'm gonna try it now. See what you guys feel. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Have you tried that? Oh, you're, have... waiting for, you're waiting for the tablet, right? Okay. Yeah. Well, because I have an iPhone, unfortunately. Okay. Well, we're going to fix that problem pretty soon. Just have to wait a uh, week or so. We'll have that problem fixed for you. Okay. So this is called like the DMT daydream frequency. Oh. It is, somebody just said it's so soothing, it is, it's like, it puts you instantly into this trance, right? You get instantly into this trance of like, you feel like your thoughts just left your head and you're like, nothing, you feel like stone yeah. kind of. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Thank you so much for coming by, Kim. Hey, Kim. How's it going? Oh, Demichi wants a dance party. That's funny. <laughs> like we have, last time we did this, like, we were playing these frequencies, and then they had these rhythms, so we were just dancing to them. Which one was I playing that time, Demichi? Do you remember? It gets you pretty, like, upbeat. Makes you feel like... <laughs> yeah. Makes you feel like lucky or something. <laughs> right. Someone asked how long did you do it for. Hmm? Someone just asked how long did you do it for. So maybe like run frequencies. Thirty minutes that. to thirty minutes to three hours. We don't recommend more than three hours a day. You don't probably don't need more than three hours. Uh, another neat thing is that you can play frequencies and use the coils at the same time. So um, the coils are silent, by the way, right? There's no sound coming from them. Unless you re put a magnet to them, then there's actually sound. Interesting, interesting, interesting point. But if the coils by themselves don't make any sound, they, but they do have a magnetic energy. So how, how you can actually combine the, um, you can combine the sound. So we have these speakers you can get, or you can just buy them anywhere. Uh, but you can split up this signal from our transducers. Where's my splitter? Okay, my splitter's over there. So you can split up the signal. So they come into, so you can split up the signal. One can go into the coil, and then one will go to the speakers. And now you're getting sound therapy, and you're getting the uh, PMF therapy simultaneously. There, there you go. You got one. Uh, yeah. 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 So the only downside is you just have to use one coil. Then you can't use both of them. Uh, unless you add another splitter, then you have <laughs> two coils, and then you have the sound <laughs> on the other side. <laughs> coils everywhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. I did want to circle back when you were when you were talking about using the frequencies. How did you first find out about frequencies? Where you just started researching alternative? Yeah. So when I was sick, I just felt like I wanted to become more spiritual. I just felt like I wanted to learn meditation and deepen my my uh, intuition and kind of just research and just experiment with that uh, side of myself more because at that time my friend was really into meditation like he was meditating something like four hours a day or something like that and it just fascinated me with what he told me about the experiences were so i started to kind of practice what he was doing and then at the same time i was going online and then uh, i found meditation frequencies and i said hmm, you know i was studying music before so i i knew that music had this effect on your emotions and, and things like that. Um, and I played a lot of music when I was in church, you know, I played piano and things like that. So I, I was, always knew that music had something to do with, uh, or had direct connection with spiritual spirituality. So 
I just kind of experimented with more frequencies. And then when I did, I had this really profound experience. Like I was listening to this frequency. I was just taking a nap and um, I listened to it for probably like 45 minutes or so, just with my headphones. And then I went to the bathroom and then I was just sitting on the toilet, okay? But then what happened was I just, my mind just blanked out and I felt like everything just blacked out. And I felt like I was in an auditorium and then there were like thousands of people looking at me. And at the same time, I was watching myself. I don't know, it's just a really trippy experience. And wow. I, was, I didn't take any drugs, I wasn't doing anything. I was just sitting there reading a book, right? <laughs> but then this experience happened and it was so vivid and so real. And then obviously I knew it was, had to do with the frequency I was listening to for 40 minutes. And then at that point, at that point on, I said, wow, there's something to this, something to this uh, frequency and meditation and, and, uh, and getting into those brain altered states. So then I went more deeply into it and then eventually uh, started experimenting with devices as well. And that's how I heal myself. So actually my healing journey started because of my spiritual journey. Because at that time, I didn't even, I wasn't really looking for a way to, to heal myself. Like, I, it would be nice to heal myself at that time, but I thought that I was going to live with that disease my whole life. Yeah. So, so through my spiritual journey or through my seeking of spiritual enlightenment, I accidentally healed myself. That's my story. <laughs> best accident ever. <laughs> yeah, best accident ever. Yeah. And do you, I mean, do you have a, do you have like a an educational background in like quantum physics and... Like, how did you get into designing your own, designing the cheek oil, like designing the well, product? Um, I'm not sure if I mentioned, but um, I was in engineering at the University of British Columbia. I got a $10,000 scholarship to study my full four-year term as an engineer. Many, you know, not many people get that full scholarship. So, but what I did with it was I actually quit because <laughs> I didn't want to be an engineer. I didn't want to work a job, an entrepreneur. And I hate working for somebody else. So then I started studying music. Instead, I went to Capilano University and studied jazz music. So there I learned, you know, studied piano and guitar and singing and things like that. Um, so that's about it. <laughs> and, and just from my own personal experience through practicing Qigong and meditate, you know, um, martial arts and, uh, and Tai Chi. I've been practicing for decades and just combining all those different aspects of skills and experience and sensitivities allowed me to create this, create this technology, right? Because there may be some engineers that, oh, I figure out how to do this. This is how this works and connect all the wires properly. And they may, may maybe musicians that create really great frequencies and there may be some very good energy healers, but I'm kind of like all three. Yeah. So, so that makes me unique in that I can combine all these things together into one. And I'm also an amazing like world-class marketer and entrepreneur. So, <laughs> so that makes um, all those combinations makes for success and yeah. makes for creating something really amazing. It's extremely impressive, I have to say. And like just looking at the different models, I'm like, I've already got my Christmas list going. <laughs> um, the um, with the dual with the yin and the yang, what's what's the benefit of having the two opposing coils as opposed to just the one? Just that it's higher power, or it's just I mean, a different experience. It's just something you have to experience. It's really kind of difficult to explain. You know, um, you know about ley lines, right? Lay. Planet, ley lines oh planet. yeah okay so you know stonehenge is on a specific ley line you know you know the emperor's palace or the mayans build their palaces or their uh, pyramids they're all on ley lines right but did you know that they have feminine yin ley lines and masculine yang ley lines so ley lines have yin and yang too hmm. so where do you think they put those sacred spots where the yin and the yang intersect, okay? 
So there's some very special, profound power that occurs when you combine yin and yang and when they intersect with each other. Well, think about when a man and a woman connect, we create life, right? So this is a universal concept and this is a concept that is true in nature. So when you have, based on that concept, when you have yin and yang, they're opposing each other, in the middle, something very special happens. The, the opposing magnetic fields actually create a third kind of wave. Mm. Talk about it much, but it's called a scalar wave. Okay. So, and I don't want to get into scalar energy, but basically, scalar energy travels faster than light. It travels backwards and forwards in time, and it travels um, instantaneously. Okay, but you can't detect it, but you can direct it with your consciousness. So I don't want to get too woo woo with <laughs> with my stuff, but um, but it's. But that's the concept behind the yin and the yang. And um, one additional aspect and one additional experience that you can, you can have when you use them, the yin and yang together. Okay. Yeah. Now, when you run, when you do programs, do you, um, I always tell people it's important to set intention, you know, because your thoughts also direct the energy as well. What are your, what's your stance on that? Well, yes. Um, well, what, what's happening when you just increase your electrical activity in your body uh, or your voltage, like you can actually measure your body's voltage. What's going to happen is you become a more effective projector or more effective sender of frequency or resonance. So if you have an intention in your mind, this will amplify it because it amplifies that effect in your body. And when that amplifies that, so whatever intention in your mind, that's going to project it further or more precisely or uh, create a larger impact or make it happen faster, help you manifest more intensely. Uh, so that's what it does. So yeah, your intentions, whatever you have while using the corals will be amplified. Once you understand how the energy works and that you can actually manipulate it, it's pretty... Miracles happen. Okay, let's get into the metaphysical stuff. Let's. So we talked yes, about the yes. science stuff. I want to emphasize that this is based on science first, right? It's pulse electromagnetic frequency therapy. Okay, there's about 80 years of studies done by thousands of doctors, scientists all around the world showing PMF therapy helps with all sorts of different conditions. Okay, this is proven. This is probably accepted in the, in the medical community. Okay, we base our coils on that. Okay, so... Have that in your mind. That now we can talk about the metaphysical stuff. Because whenever I talk about metaphysical stuff, people think, oh, it's all woo-woo, and they think that now it's not a science anymore, in a pseudoscience, okay? Yeah. Now, we have the science. We actually have done studies with our coils, uh, quality of assessments, and we can we show that it improves people's sleep, anxiety, meditation, um, mindfulness, uh, 15 to 30% across the board. We, we surveyed 200 people. Hundred of them didn't use any of my products. A hundred of them using my cheat codes and frequencies, and you can clearly see a huge difference, uh, uh, statistically, extremely statistically significant variation in their improvement in the quality of life. Okay, so it's scientifically proven. So let's now talk about metaphysical stuff. So what happens when you use the cheat codes is it actually gets you into these brainwave states that allow you to unlock different parts of your consciousness. So we know that we have different brain waves, alpha, beta, gamma, theta, delta, right? When we are in our wakeful state, let's say we're watching this video, we're working, we're usually in beta. And we need to be in beta because we're alert and we're, we can, you know, we're, we want to, you know, use that because that's what we need in order to function uh, normally. But then if you go a little lower into alpha, what happens is you start to really relax and you start to stop using too much of your frontal cort cortex. You start to balance out the usage of your brain. And when that happens, you it's kind of like the daydreaming effect. You know what? When you daydream, you're, like, you're there, your eyes are open, but then you have this scene happening in front of you that 
where you're in and your consciousness is somewhere else where your body is one place. Mm. So once you get to alpha, that's the state where you have the most intuition and creativity. And that's the place that you can actually start attracting uh, the things that you want and manifesting the things that you want, that you have intentions for. Okay. But you have to drop yourself down into the alpha. Now, what happens if you drop deeper, like into delta, theta, and so on? Now, the deeper you go, and this only happens usually during sleep. Some people can get into those really low states even while they're awake. Okay. But that takes a lot of training. But basically, if you get your brain waves slowed down to that level, then you enter into some very um, super consciousness states where you can start accessing the field or the universal field of consciousness. You know how we have dreams, right? Like who's had a dream where something happened and it actually happened in real life later on? Okay. So is it just a coincidence or do we actually have a connection with, uh, have precognitive abilities, right? What does the science say? Science actually proves that we have precognitive abilities. That means that our, we can tell the future. And how they did this, and they did a study by showing pictures on a computer screen. And they showed some regular pictures that don't do anything. But then once in a while, they'll show a very uh, naughty picture, like, let's just say, right? <laughs> that would like trigger some kind of chemicals in the brain or whatever, right? Or they show something very gross and it'll trigger some chemical in the brain. So what happened is that they did this study on hundreds of people and they measured the person's heart and their brain activity. And what happened was that after the hundreds of thousands of tests, they saw that the heart reacted and made a signal five seconds before the image was shown. So it was five seconds faster than the brain. Mm. So the heart had precognitive ability. The heart was able to or uh, reacted or knew that it was going to see that picture that caused that reaction five seconds before it happened. And this was, this happened for uh, most of the people. And the people who did it the best are business people, successful entrepreneurs. Why? Apparently, successful entrepreneurs have more intuition. So science proves that we actually have precognitive abilities. And it's our hearts react physically to it before something happens. So what happens when you get yourself into those deeper brainwave states, you actually start connecting with that heart mind, right? Because we have different minds. We have our intellectual mind. We have our heart mind. We have our gut mind. And we have our uh, spiritual mind as well, right? So when you get into those lower brainwave states, you get to start connecting and communicating with those other minds that you have. And, and why I'm saying this is because one of the best ways to get into those brainwave states is through brainwave tuning. Um, and that's what we use with our frequencies and with our coils. We can actually get you into those brainwave states like an automatic driving car, right? You don't need to, you, the training will definitely help. Like if you have a, program or we have a method of getting to those states it's good to learn those things but with this it makes it even more powerful it makes it a lot easier and it makes it a lot more consistent and and uh repeatable so that's another aspect of our technology is it just gets you into those meditative brainwave states that have helped you to unlock you can say like superhuman abilities such as precognition or it can unlock, um, well, one thing for sure is people have more dreams when they use our product, okay? So you just started, I'm not sure if you started having dreams, more dreams, but pretty much like 90% of the people after you use it for a couple of weeks, they say, well, why am I dreaming so much? Oh, or, or they may even say, hey, I never, I haven't dreamed for the last five years and now I have a dream, right? So those kind of things happen and, um, and it's because it's changing the way your consciousness works. It's changing the way your brain works. It's unlocking those brainwave states that you normally are not tapping into. Why? Because 
because life is busy. We don't have time. And another reason is Wi-Fi and 5G screwing with our brains. And all the frequencies that we are exposed to on a daily basis is slowly, daily messing our brains and our DNA. So, it may be, so we're being displaced and removed from the original powerful human being that we're supposed to be because this technology is literally altering our brainwaves. So what we need is we need a technology to protect ourselves. And we need a technology that can retune us to our original human power of being able to tap into our human, innate, natural born abilities to have the superhuman abilities. So that's the metaphysical aspect of our coils. And that's what really excites me. I mean, the healing, that's exciting. But what's also exciting is, is, the, is the spiritual experience and the transformation that you can possibly you can you can experience with this it's funny that you mentioned the dreams because i woke up this morning after lucid dreaming and i haven't had that in a long time i mean really? you know you get, you get the hormonal pregnancy dreams but it was it was one of those situations where i woke up and i was like okay was was that a dream was i there am i in my own room but now that you say that, it's like it had to have been from running the programs, you know, even for the short time of day, because I'm, you know, I'm used to using Healy a lot, but not, it, it's, it does, the, the power does not compare to these things. These things are strong to say the least, but it is, that's, it's such a beautiful explanation because I don't think, you know, I think over time we forget how, how powerful our minds are and with the technology, how, how, how detrimental it can be. So another question I had is as far as like those, the negative effects from the EMF, obviously that will, it will start to reverse it, but does it offer protection from those incoming EMFs that we don't want when you're running the coils? Yeah. So a lot of people are concerned about EMFs and they should be, and they think um, the solution is to block it. Let's, Let's stop it from coming at me, right? Let's let's create a shield. Let's create a blocker, but but in reality, you can't because five G goes through everything, okay? And um, you have to basically live in an underground bunker and shield yourself like with some pretty serious equipment, like hundred thousand dollars worth of equipment, in order to like shield yourself from five G or, or or EMS. And that's not realistic. And actually, that's not even that healthy. Because if you shield yourself from the Earth's magnetic field, then you're not getting what you need as well. So our solution to that is to increase your own magnetic field, okay? Increase your own uh, energetic resonance so that even if you are bombarded by these uh, frequencies and Wi-Fi and 5G, it's not going to affect you. Because your frequency is so strong, your, your resonance is so much higher, and you're vibrating in such mm -hmm. a positive and healthy rates that none of that is going to affect you. And that's what we're seeing happening. Um, and that's exactly why you're probably having more dreams and why people uh, improve their health and improve their wellness and why people are um, less affected. They, uh, their uh, brain fog clears up and they're able to do a lot of things they, they, they never did for years. Uh, be, it's because their body has started becoming more resilient and their, and their energy field is becoming stronger and they're creating this natural protection against EMFs in their own body. I've seen those those huge systems that you can buy to like put around your house to protect from the, the 5G and stuff. That's not really necessary if you're using- I'm, I'm sure they work. I'm sure they work, but you're probably right when you say it's not necessary, right? Like I said, the blocking idea is not very great, great because what, what happens when you leave the house? What, you can stay in your house forever, right? You can't, no, yeah. you can't leave the house. Like, what if you want to leave the house? What do you want to go out? What do you want to go, go walk your dog or go to the park or go traveling, right? You know, then you can't if, if that's the case. So you need some a better solution that where you can bring this with you and recharge yourself whenever you need it and be protected and be less and basically be be immune to um, to this harmful radiation and harmful five G. Um, 
that's the that's the way that's the real way of of um doing it is to increase your own resonance i think that's offering more comfort because it's you know i get a lot of questions like how do i protect myself and it's like you're you're never going to be fully aware away yeah. from it like it's there's it's actually a another um technology that i've developed uh i haven't shown here yet but that deals with that directly okay mm. so um emf protection so what we do is we actually reharmonize the 5G sig uh, signals themselves. Okay, so there's one way I just explained, right? One way is to increase your own resilience, increase your own energy field so that those harmful waves won't hurt you. You're protected from them because you're just stronger than them. Okay, the second way is actually change the resonance of the 5G themselves and reharmonize it so that it becomes um, harmless. But we took it a step further. We reharmonize it to be not just harmless. We reharmonize it so that's beneficial for you. Okay, yeah, it was really fun. We should do yeah, this again. And uh, I'm really glad. I'm really glad that you uh, experienced it um, very quickly and getting some changes and and even uh, even metaphysical changes as well. So yeah. um, I'd love to do this again. And uh, you guys. I'll be, take, I'll be taking it on my trip with me. My sister's super. She's like, yes, bring it with you. I want to see it. I want to use it. So. Yeah. 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 So if you want to um, start experiencing it, just go to Laura's page or her um, her link wall and there's a link on there. You can use her discount code and get a discount. Um, you can start with the frequencies. You can start with the coils. You can start with anything you want. So thank you guys so much. Um, we're going to do another live. We'll just, I'll let you know ahead of time. David, again, thank you so much. It was a pleasure and an honor. And I'll speak to you soon. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. Bye, guys. Good night.